Hey guys, this is Navinia. Welcome back to Naveen Automation Labs. So a quick scenario with Selenium with respect to zoom in and zoom out of your web page. Sometimes what happens when you land on this page, by default, it's a 100% a current position. That's a viewpoint. Okay, that's a view, current view position over here with this particular application. But for example, let's say if I really want to uh, zoom in and zoom out from the keyboard, generally what exactly we do, we press control if you are having the windows machine or a command with the mac machine with minus see it's actually see 90 percent 80 percent so we are going to zoom out here if you really want to zoom in then we have to start pressing control plus plus or command plus plus here and you can see that i can see zoom in and then more and more zoom in i can do that so what if i really want to do the same thing with the selenium can we do that? Yes. So with the JavaScript executor, it's super simple to do that. What you do, let's go to inspect of your browser. In the Chrome browser, let's see the first thing in the Chrome first. And uh, here you just need to execute one uh, command. For example, see I'm writing it here. That is a document dot body dot style and then dot a zoom style that you have to use the zoom property is equal to for example, let's say if I'm writing the zoom, zoom property should be 50%. So you can write 50% here. See, the 50% zoom is done. If you really want to increase to 100% back to 100%, then again back to 100%. If you want to make it to 10%, now see this is 10%. Let's check uh, more than 100% also. Let's see if I really want to make it up to 200%. 200% is, uh, zoom in is done okay that's really good same thing you can use in the form of for point value also this is in the form of percentage for example if i'm writing that uh, okay let's make it around uh, uh, let's see 0 0.8 percent it means 80 percent so see now this is 80 percent zoom oh uh, that's maybe after 200 percent to 0 0.8 percent so i'll do one thing again back to let's see 100 percent and then i'm saying let's make it to 0.8 percent once again see this is 0.8 percent or i can say that uh, again back to 8.0 percent so see 8.0 percent slightly it is getting increased or you can say uh i would say 0 0.80 this is more or less so likewise you can do that for example again back to 100 percent see again back to 100 percent that is also perfectly fine right so for example, if I say that, no, we have to make it to, let's see, 1.4%. See, this is 1.4%. That also, this is fine. That also you can do it. And let's see, again, I'm making it to 14.0%. So that is again. So any number that you can give in the form of percentage or you can give the point value also. So let's make it again back to uh, 100%, again back to normal. So if the same script that you run it in your uh, Selenium, with the help of JavaScript executor, you can easily change this parameter, this value as a parameter. You can create a generic function out of it and then you can start using it. So this is something really good. So let's do that. So let's see, I'm launching my application here with the Chrome browser first, and then I'm going to create the uh, driver and then this driver I'm actually going to cast into JavaScript executor because I'm going to use JavaScript executor here. So I'll say that this is my JavaScript uh executor here javascript executor is the interface which will help me to execute the javascript on the browser so let's see this is a reference that i have created and then i'm going to write execute script method that i'm going to write and then uh, what is your script name so this is a script that we have to pass it over here so i'll do one thing i'll maintain one let's see this is my zoom chrome script is equal to in double quote and i'm going to copy this exactly same thing from here copy this and then paste it over here okay let me remove uh, these things okay 100.0 percent let's see then i really want to try with the let's see around 50 percent zoom percentage and then the same zoom chrome a script that i'm going to write it here execute on the browser so let's see with the help of selenium script am i able to do it or not so run as Java application, browser will be launched and then the zoom percentage I have provided 50% zoom should be done. See, this is nice. So sometimes what happens with the 100% zoom or maybe some specific variable or element is not visible. So that also you can change it or uh, you can check for the responsive testing also with the different 
zoom in zoom out percentage you can check your application with the automation with selenium in these kind of use cases you can use this particular feature now let's make it around uh, let's see around 400 percent let's see so 400 percent means 400 zoom in that's such a big font size automatically font size and everything it means 400 percent it's zoomed in now right so that also you can do it after maximize the screen also that also you can really want to apply after maximizing of the browser that also you can do it but remember the same thing will not work in the firefox so if you really want to check in the firefox let's open a firefox over here so for example let's say i'm going to open a new window here and then i'm going to write the same application here let's see uh let's use the same application here copy the url and then i'm going to use this application here okay anyways let me restart the firefox once again so with firefox this might not work so let's see i'm entering this application here right click on it and uh, go to inspect go to console let's try this script over here so what exactly we have written we are writing the same script here and then paste it here and uh, let's see i'm running it with the 100 percent instead of 100 percent i'm saying okay run it with the 50 percent see i'm making it 50 percent but it's not zooming out okay so this is not working here so style.zoom will not work in the firefox so then firefox what should i do in firefox everything will remain same the only thing is that you have to use it instead of style.zoom there is another property that you have to use especially with the firefox that is called mozilla um mozilla transform you have to use it this one okay now let's try this so mozilla transform and then that is also not equal to 50 percent one more thing you have to use it here that is um scale property function you have to use it and a scale let's see up to two if you're writing it like this and now see the scale two means again 200 percent scale so i'll show you once again see what you have to do simple write document dot body dot style dot moz transform is equal to scale 2 it means 200 percent and let's say scale 1 again back to normal and then if i'm writing <coughs> scale 0 0.5 it means half of this so see this half of this it means 50 percent scaling uh, zoom out i'm doing it here so this is the script that you have to use it right so remember in your framework if you really want to use you have to maintain a separate java scripts for chrome and firefox so i'm writing this is let's see for firefox and which is equal to in double code let's see i'm writing it here and this one you have to use it okay now let's try with the firefox it's working or not so let's try with the firefox driver and uh, import firefox driver everything will remain same and here i'm passing zoom firefox here right so i'm not using this particular uh, script i'm using this particular script for the firefox with the scale so let's see it should be scaled to 0 0.5 means 50 percent scaling so see it's opening and uh, after launching the application yes see it's 50 percent scaling is done on firefox so with this thing you can check your application behavior that it's perfectly working fine or not such a responsive testing you can do it with these number of options same thing you can try this thing will work with the safari and the edge browser also you can try it i have already tried in my windows laptop so it's working fine safari also it will work and then for mozilla you can try this one okay so i'm writing it here this will work for edge browser as well as the safari browser also and then the for chrome and this is only for firefox remember this thing so that's it uh, it's super simple just remember this thing if someone is asking you this thing at the time of interview this is a way you can just simply do it here like this okay now you later on you can create a generic function where you can just pass the percentage number and that number you just need to append it here and then you are just good to go and then create a generic function out of it and that's it so now you can create these two simple methods two generic methods whenever you want to zoom with chrome and firefox see i have created these two methods zoom chrome and zoom with firefox just need to pass the zoom percentage or zoom a scaling number or percentage over here here i'm writing document dot body dot style dot zoom and whatever the zoom percentage is coming i'm appending here so i have to generate this particular 
a script so let's say you are passing 400 percentage same thing for firefox we have to use a scale and then this is the number that i'm passing zoom percentage and then i'm just appending it over here that's it so let me quickly check that so now you don't need to write this script again and again just comment it out launch your application whenever you want to uh, zoom in zoom out just simple call it if it is firefox i'm going to call this particular method so let's call it zoom firefox here i'm saying that i really want to do with 0.5 scaling so let's see is it really working or not so zoom firefox method will be called zoom is getting launched and it should be see 50 percent that's absolutely working fine let's quickly check with the chrome also so here i'm writing chrome driver and uh, instead of calling zoom firefox i'm going to call zoom chrome here but in zoom chrome we have to pass what a percentage format we have to pass let's see don't pass percentage exactly percentage you just pass simple number let's say i'm saying uh, 300 point a zero that's it percentage will be automatically appended here in this method so you don't need to pass the percentage just simple write 300.0 that's it so let's see it is picking or not so it should uh, zoom in up to 300 percent with chrome browser so you can see chrome is getting launched and yes so 300 percent means it's such a big font size is coming here so it's absolutely fine here so these two methods you can just simple use it start using in your framework whenever you really want to do a Zoom in, zoom out with the Chrome and Firefox. You can just simply do that. That's it for this particular video. I see you the next video. Till then, take care and share this video with others who are looking for such kind of features. Thank you so much, guys.